<laughs> oh yeah, we in the middle of <laughs> who knows Atlantic City. Uh, I don't like it here. It's dark and scary. Who knows? This is Becca. <laughs> I have to pee. Yeah, she has to pee. <laughs> That's her introduction. She has to pee. <laughs> Y'all ready for this sketchy wild mouse and a kitty coaster? Slowest wild mouse ever. It was it was so unbelievably slow. I thought it was gonna like saddle at some point. <laughs> yeah, right. But yeah, smooth. Uh, I would say I would say it was worth eight tickets. We paid twenty one dollars for two coasters. Not worth it. <laughs> All right, Matt, what'd you think of this kitty coaster? That was worth the six tickets. Yes, it was. <laughs> yeah, I don't know who manufactured this thing. I'm pretty sure it's LNT, but probably the smoothest kitty coaster ever. It was butter smooth. How many times did we go? Like four. four. That was three too many. Yeah, three too many. I agree, but at least it was smooth and the cars were pretty big. All right, so we're done with uh, Steel Pier. Woo! So uh, we're going to go to Wildwood now and actually ride some good coasters. Wheelwood. Oh, here's my current situation. Thank God Becca's here. <laughs> here we are. Oh, dude, let me kick the beach ball. Well, I don't know if Great White's open because it's kind of just sitting dormant. And last I heard, they were doing retracking on it and getting new trains for it. So if you look over here, you can see lots of retracking on Great White. So I don't know if that's what they're doing, but there's a train stack on the brakes right here. So I'm thinking maybe it was open, this is closed today, I, I don't know. But I mean, I already have the credit, Matt has the credit. I Matt has the credit. Yeah, everyone has it, so. But while we're here, might as well get pictures of it. All right, first, since we aren't sure if Great Way is gonna open today, because there are guys up there, so the ride might just be down. Um, but we're gonna start with the screaming swing. All right, so we just got off the screen and swing. It was Becca's first time on one of those. Yeah. So what did you think of it? I thought it was pretty interesting, you know, it threw me off a little bit, but I like yeah. airtime. I think, I think Great Adventure should definitely get one of these. I, I'm, that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. I was sitting on the side where when you would go up, you'd be looking over Great White structure, and it was really cool because it was kind of like a little foot chopper effect. And that one had really good airtime to it. Look, we're finally at Cedar Point, guys. We made it. <laughs> Word. Okay, right, that's what I came for over there at SLC. Hey, man, what do you want to ride? You want to ride it? Ride what? You want to ride it? Ride what? You want to ride it? Oh. Man's is not having it. Man's is not happy riding this thing all day. Yeah, man's is not happy riding this thing all day. A little family coaster. Yeah, that was cute. It was really smooth. Yeah. Like, uh, I was surprised. Yeah. First off, it has laterals. It has like a little bit of floater. 
and some good positives. So it's, it's definitely a solid family coaster. I really enjoyed it. now that Vacoma did a great job retracting this thing. It was, wasn't butter smooth, but you could, it was definitely, there's no head banging, mainly just a little bit of like bumps here and there, but overall, pretty smooth ride. Uh, I would honestly re-ride it, like it wasn't that bad. It used to be one of the worst coasters that I've ridden, but ever since they retracted and uh, refurbished the trains and even reprofiled some spots, like it's a different layout in some spots in terms of, uh, like the, how sharp the turns are, it's pretty good. Would recommend it. Boy, shut the f up, you built like a... Yo, why are these teacups going so damn fast? So we came to one of the gift shops. Very nice looking, that I add. And then we just got some supports going to the building for Sea Serpent. Smell like you farted. So for those of you who have never been to this park before, Maury's does this thing where they do an inspection on their coasters like halfway through the day, and it usually takes pretty long. So we've been waiting to ride this for a long time. The only reason we're gonna bother riding it because of the new train. So we don't even know when it's gonna open. They sent one cycle earlier, and they're closing restraints now. So hopefully it opens up sometime soon because we kind of want to go home now. So any ride up will know what these things are. If you know what they are, let me know in the comments. <laughs> Yo, this train is really cool. It's got the year on it. It's got like some decals over there. It's got some kind of seat for poles. So they're letting people in into Great White right now, so we're flying. We're gonna ride it, it's gonna be the last thing, then we're gonna head out for the day. All right, we're back over here. I've not seen Great White send one train yet, but they're bringing people onto the station, so that could be only gonna be a good sign. Enjoy your ride.
was average. Um, it's a lot rougher than it was back when I rode it, you know, six years ago, but uh, it, was, it was all right. You know, I had some decent moments with floaters and lateral. Oh, brother, this guy stinks! Yo, it's our pal Earl over here. Whoa, 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 whoa. What? We have a secret handshake. You want to see it? Ah, uh, sure, yeah. 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 Damn, that just looks more like abuse to his mouth. <laughs> nah, he likes it. <laughs> let, me, let me know if she hurts you, okay? All right, it's time to be hella nerdy. We going out on the beach just to get coaster photos. Alright, so after this little content run for Great White, uh, I think we're gonna end our day here at Maury's. Uh, pretty good day, it was nice to come back after like five years or something, like six years, no, six years, yeah.